The Colorado Academy Girls Lacrosse Program, a very storied program, currently atop the Colorado High School Activities Association poll and winners of eight state titles. But the last one was 15 years ago. Head coach Steph Sanders feels like she has her team on track this year, and she's doing it with a lot of underclassmen, led by junior Anna Gallagher. Gallagher comes in. She's so solid. She's one of the leaders back there on defense, and she's one of the players who Coach Sanders says is calm, reliable, and really is one of the premier defenders in this game. On the other side for Mullen, it's Zoe Ryan, the midfielder, solid in transition. She and the Mullen Mustangs need to lock down Colorado Academy and focus on execution. We've got the Colorado Academy Mustangs against the Mullen Mustangs. It's a Mustangs matchup. Non-league style right here on the Xfinity Sports Report Game of the Week. Let's get this one started. Three minutes into the game, CA's Jackie Melberg showing her speed and a quick pass to Claire Wright who sends it home for an early 1-0 lead. A minute and a half later, Mullen's Allie Vanek finds Zoe Ryan. She'll shoot, but the shot is blocked and bounces right back in her stick. She stays with it, makes some nice moves, and hits the top back corner of the net to tie it at one. 40 seconds later, CA in transition. Sydney Prokopek to Henley Hall. She'll sneak past the keeper, CA back on top, two to one. 18.42 on the clock, Mullen answers right back. Callie Edgar hits a running Sarah Merrifield. She'll drill it to the threads. We're knotted at two apiece. Four and a half later, CA up three, two. Maddie Webster finds Emma Richards, hits the low goal for a 4-2 CA Mustangs lead. And that would be the last score for CA the rest of the half. 9.30 on the board, Mullen down by one. Kelly Edgar dishes it to Vanek, she'll take it home. We are back at a tied game, four to four. A short time later, Mullen and Kelly Edgar at it again. Nice shake and bake move here. Hits the underhand shot to the net. Mullen out in front, five to four with eight to play in the half. Now a minute to play, Mullen's Allie Vanek finds open real estate. Fires it past the keeper for the Mustangs, sixth goal and the two point lead. Closing seconds in the half, Vanek making the highlights again. This time under pressure, the nice shot on goal. She'd have four in the game as Mullen goes on a 5-0 tear to lead CA 7-4 going into the break. To the second, Mullen starts to pull away. Zoe Ryan with the toss to Sarah Merrifield. She'll hit her second goal. Mullen jumps out to a 8-4 lead with 17.38 left. Under nine to play, CA's Ella Anist making the bounce goal attempt, but is denied by keeper Cami Cisneros, just one of her nine saves. CA would keep fighting back as freshman Lauren Russell, who had two goals, would circle the net, get the point. CA pulls to within one at nine to eight with 2.56 to play. Seconds to go in the game, Mullen playing shorthanded. CA with one last attempt, but they would run out of time as Mullen pulls off the upset with a 9-8 win over number one ranked Colorado Academy. You know, I think it was just hard at the end of the day and um, body positioning and just really like sticking to your roots. And um, I mean, we made mistakes for sure, but I mean, at the, it was just desire and we really wanted to come out here and win and beat this team. And that's what happened on the field. And that's, you know, the results show our heart and effort, so. I think it was just like Cammie said, hustling heart and I think we needed to start off and in the second half strong and I think we did and yeah like they came back and scored a couple but we knew we had to stay in it and I think our execution at the end with just controlling the ball and just running it around I think that's what held us in it. Well we just had a team approach. If we were going to win this game today it was everybody that was on the field was going to be involved and that's exactly what happened at the end. Uh, and throughout the game, we, our defense stepped up. Even though we were a player down, they really gritted it out and got that ball back. So it was a team effort. We knew we would not win as individuals, and the team knew that, and we came together as a team, both offensively and defensively. So, Well, a fantastic game. The Mullen Mustangs went on a 5-0 run to take the lead at half, 7-4, and they hold on for a 9-8 upset of number one Colorado Academy. The Mustangs showed a lot of uh, resiliency today, overcoming the, the conditions, but more importantly, played with a lot of heart to take this victory. On the other side for Colorado Academy, first loss in Colorado. They had two blemishes, but it came uh, in spring break last week against California. 
they're going to have to regroup, come back, and know that there's no easy road to the, the state title match, and the Mullen Mustangs sure made a statement here today. That'll do it for the Xfinity Sports Report. Game of the Week, I'm Mary Kay Morrow.